All right, you got your enemy boat coming from um, your starboard side, which is the right side of your submarine. He'll be passing through and we'll have access, we'll be hitting from his port side, his left side. And these are a way to remember it as port is four letters and left is four letters. So port is the left side. So we're 1.2 kilometers away from his course, roughly, just a little bit. Um, use these maps. You know what the map does. All right. So, um, we'll get them a little closer. And we'll take a look through our periscope. Zero this out. He's going to be roughly, I don't know, I don't know Let's raise our periscope up a little bit. Okay, there he is. He's roughly 30 degrees based on our bearing. Our bearing is our direction we're heading. So whichever way we're heading, we're at zero degrees. Which is the, the, head, the bearing of the boat is zero degrees. Our course is different from the bearing. So the bearing um, off our ship is roughly 29 degrees to his port side. He's heading to the left. Let's identify the ship, it's easy. Um, you have the Empire Explorer. It's pretty easy to identify. Um, it, it took me like a, a couple hours to figure out memorize them so we got the uh, empire explorer we'll recognize that then we'll go to velocity you can, you can uh, determine velocity by starting the stopwatch and then pressing set when the bow goes over it you watch it all the way through until it gets to the stern we'll just forget about that because i already know it's seven kilometers per hour the distance we can determine by clicking on this button use the q or the e button on your computer i'm playing on a pc so Xbox and other things. I don't know what those are. So you use a cue boat to raise the shadow up here. So it's just about the the bottom of the highest point on the ship, and it's 1.06 meters or 1.06 kilometers. Uh, 1,006. Forget it. All right. So we know he's right now about 15 degrees off our. Um, bearing of zero, zero direction we're heading so to him we are 85 84 83 or whatever, 82 it says down here which is roughly correct so it's going to be a negative number 82 because he is heading left off his port if he was heading right let's turn to 80. oh come on all right i'm going to say 79 i guess now let's make it 78. All right, so we got to call these numbers out to the person uh, calculating the, the torpedo's course. So we hit on this little thing Attack here. Attack parameters it update. Out. This little light Speed, will come on and say it's there. Seven knots. The distance. Attack parameters call update. Call it out. Distance one zero six four We're meters. Actually, negative eighty-five. And the update angle eight five bow left flood tube two. All right, you flood your torpedo. I'm going to pause the game for a second. All right, so you hear, see as he's getting to be close to our zero degrees, directly off our the bow of our ship, so straight line to him. From his view, we're to his left. If he was on the ship, he'd look to the left and see us, and we're roughly four degrees um, off the left, but not it'd be negative four, so it'd be... <laughs> you have the four points of the compass... 360s, zero degrees. East is 90, south is 180, and west is 270. So 270 minus 4, but because it's off our bearing, it's 0 minus 4. Because he's heading to the left, we're looking at his port. This sounds complicated now I'm saying it, but it's Update. really simple. A -O -B Let's start eight, it up. Seven, two, two, Wait left, till the left. gyro is synchronized. It is, and we'll fire. fire. Go to our map view. And we can zoom in and see this, the torpedo leave our ship. Roughly. There it is. Okay. Exit this and click on the torpedo and select that. Go to the torpedo angle. So you don't have to draw any circles or protractor marks on your map to do it. Just look at your, your periscope. Speed it up. 
30 seconds. 20 seconds. I was heading for his stack right there. And I came pretty close. Not a little bit off, but it's alright. It's gonna so this took me a week to figure out how to do this. So I figured I'd make a video because maybe there's one other idiot like me out there that doesn't know how to do this kind of thing. And you might get something out of it. I don't know. So I'm going to surface. Yeah, we're going to come up over there. Ship, our submarine should pop up out of the, the water over there. Alright, so the ship sunk. You know what to do for the rest. There you, are. there we are right there. That's us coming up. Alright, so um, I'm sure this didn't help anybody because it's just uh, a bunch of rambling and no understandable speech <laughs> of how to do it. But maybe you'll figure it out. I don't know. Good luck.